Mr. Grizzly's Class, Cecilia's Fundraiser, by Brian Patrick Avery. Table of Contents, Chapter 1, A Sad Start. Chapter 2, Morning Meeting. Chapter 3, The Poem Project. Chapter 1, A Sad Start. The bell rang and Cecilia groaned. Oh no, she said. What's wrong? Her friend Samira asked. I forgot my tamales, Cecilia said. For the fundraiser? Samira asked. Cecilia nodded. Now I can't help raise money for the animal shelter, she said. Their teacher, Mr. Grizzly, rang the small bell on his desk. Time for our morning check-in, Mr. Grizzly said. Cecilia pulled a stack of small cards out of her desk. Each card had a different emotion on it. Excited. Angry. Happy. Sad. Cecilia put the sad card on her desk. Then she took three deep breaths. Mr. Grizzly walked around the classroom. He stopped at Cecilia's desk and looked at her sad card. Can I help? He asked. I don't know, Cecilia said. She forgot her tamales for the fundraiser, Samira explained. I really wanted to help the animals, Cecilia said. Mr. Grizzly smiled. The fundraiser isn't until this afternoon, he said. You still have time to come up with a way to help. Cecilia nodded. Mr. Grizzly? she asked. Can I speak at this morning's classroom meeting? Sure thing, Cecilia, said Mr. Grizzly. Chapter 2, Morning Meeting Time for our morning meeting, Mr. Grizzly announced. Cecilia has asked to speak to the class. Cecilia stood up. I forgot to bring the tamales for the fundraiser, she said. Oh no, Chad groaned. I was looking forward to those. I can't believe I forgot them. I was carrying them to the car, Cecilia said. But I set them down to put my poetry journal and my lunch in my backpack. How can the class help? Mr. Grizzly asked. I need an idea for a way to raise money for the animals, Cecilia said. All right, class, Mr. Grizzly said. Let's brainstorm. The class had lots of ideas. I'm going to sell copies of this portrait I drew, Madison said. You could do something like that. I'm going to juggle, Emily said. You could be my assistant. I brought samosas to sell, Ashok said. Maybe you could help me. Those are great ideas, Cecilia said but I want to do something special of my own. You write really nice poems, Camilla said. I know I would buy one. Cecilia pulled her poetry journal out of her bag. She flipped through the pages. Selling my poems is a great idea, she said, but I may need a little help. Chapter 3, The Poem Project. Cecilia decided to make a small poetry book to sell. The whole class volunteered to help. Cecilia picked out her favorite poems. I like this one the best, she told Samira. It's called, Ode to Animals. Madison drew pictures for the cover of the books. Pierre helped her. Nicole and Ryan copied the poems onto fancy paper. The rest of the class put the books together. With everyone's help, the books were finished in no time. These are perfect, Cecilia told her classmates. I don't know how to thank you. Mr. Grizzly handed Cecilia a book and a pen. Maybe you could sign a copy for the class? Mr. Grizzly asked. I think we would all like that. Let's hear it for the best poet in school. Emily called. The class clapped and cheered. Cecilia signed her name on the front of the book. She handed it to Mr. Grizzly. I know what my next poem is going to be about, she said. What's that? Mr. Grizzly asked. She grinned. The best class ever. 
The end. I hope you enjoyed this book. See you next time with another wonderful book. Bye.